Hey there everyone, I'm Balkifanoite, and welcome back to Tales of Destiny! Last time we got to the town of Moreau, and we almost got thrown in jail, but a certain bard saved us from the clutches of Eve. Okay, I'm gonna stop that. Which is this guy that's on screen right now? This is Johnny Sheedon, but you already know that. And today we are gonna go to the castle in Moreau, and we are hopefully gonna find Batista pretty soon. Yeah, we're not going to do that. It's going to be a long castle. <laughs> anyway, last time I was an idiot and I said we need to go to the harbor. No, we do not. As Johnny said, we need to go to the pier. And he meant the place where we hid when he saved us from the guards. We need to talk to this guy if you go down to the harbor and you walk around and you look for people who are going to take you to the castle. You won't find anything. Even if, you, even if you walk around there in like 15 minutes and you can't find anything. <clears throat> no comment. <laughs> anyway, let's talk to this guy. Yo, can we get a boat? So is, so is this it? Sure. But please, make sure you rescue Master Fate. No problem, dude. He's under control. Are you ready? Yes, I am. Don't worry that you're not healed up or anything. You will get free healing in the castle. Okay, let's go. Now, if only I could speed this up. Oh wait, I can! I'm the guy who edit this, aren't I? Ah, oh, there we go. We might have sped up for you, but I had to see through it. Hey. <laughs> so far, so good. And I will say, it's a simple picture, but I love the view of this place. <laughs> Where are we? This is the outer perimeter of Moreau Castle. We'll be fine once we get in. You're back in charge once we're inside. Alright, so this is Moreau Castle, and... Uh, ugh, I hate this place! It's not that this place is hard or anything. Not at all, it's just... Memories. Personal memories. I'll tell you when we go. Anyway, we have a person here, a girl to be exact. Yo, baby, we're here to help you. Johnny? Apparently she knows Johnny. Liana, how's, how are things going? How did you get here? Well, you know, from the outside. Thank you for saving me. So, who is she? There's a little surprise for you. She is the wife of the next Lord of Moreau. The interior of this castle has been changed around quite a bit. So, only the outside remains the same. Man, their taste of interior design really sucks. Johnny, please rescue him. No problem, just leave it to me. I'll rescue Fate. You just keep cool and stay out of sight. Yes. Shall we go? Sure, let's get them. Alright, so she's the wife of the next lord. But she is the wife of fate. Master Sino's uh, son. I don't think Batista became a lord in the, uh, the right way. Anyway, if you want to heal, talk to Liana again. And you will get a free, complete healing. And that was a quick rest, but I don't care because I like it. Please be careful. Says. Thank you. And for some reason, I always miss this one, but there's a treasure chest here with a life bottle in it. Okay. God, I'm not looking forward to this. This place is not bad, but. Ah! Let's go. Okay, so the reason why I hate this place so much is personal experience. There's a save point there if you want to save, by the way. But before we do anything, we have some new enemies, Killer Bees and Savages. Yeah, they got the third recolor of the Barbarians already. That is kind of bad. Oh well. <laughs> A little bit too soon to do that, I'll think, but oh well. Can't really complain, I suppose. Wow. Yeah, of course, the tractor beam spell need to... The enemies actually need to be on the ground to work. And since that... That savage there was a little bit... 
off the ground because Stan hit him. Treasure Beam spell did not work. Wow. That's pretty bad. And I think actually I'm gonna change around my party a little bit. I mean, we did get a new po oh, level up. We did get a new party member last time. We need to try him out, don't you think? Yeah, I think so too. Let's see, order, replace, uh, let's take Aphilia for a little while, she's been in my party for quite some time. And Johnny, there we go, yeah. So yeah, the story. <laughs> Why I don't like this place so much is because everyone has that one dungeon in the game that it was their first wall, so to say. You know, the place that they first got stuck in. This was my first big wall. On my first playthrough, I got so lost in this place. It was insane. I got so lost, in fact, that I actually stopped playing this game. I usually don't do that, but in this place, I, I just didn't want to play it anymore. I... Granted, I was like... Or I, actually, I was a teenager at the time, but I hated this place with a burning passion. <laughs> it's not that bad, though, I will say that. Anyway, as you saw, we got a lot of green gels in this place, at the pressure chest and stuff. But since I already have green gels, they're not really that helpful to me anyway. But, yeah. This place, I actually... I really like the music, though. It's a... It tells you something is really going on here. And another thing with this dungeon that I'm not a huge fan of is this. Look behind this bush to get a treasure, which is an orange gel. You need to look behind pretty much almost all of these bushes, because most of them actually indeed have uh, treasure behind them. It's a little bit annoying, to be quite honest, if you don't know. But I do, so it's not that bad. Oh god, the power stones. I hate those things. Let's see, no. Special Johnny Symphony. He, it's so cool that you can actually hear him, hear him sing. <laughs> I like it. Anyway, those power stones are of course the same as those crystals back in Israel's temple. Except these things, they cast magic on you. Pretty powerful magic too. It's very annoying. So if if you can, you should probably run up to the power stone to stop it from casting magic. But when it's alone, it's not a problem. You can just wail on it, and it will not be able to cast magic on you at all. And as you see, we get a lot of lens and gold and pretty much everything in this place. That's very nice, actually. <laughs> anyway, another treasure chest here with another green gel. Oh, damn you, game! And we have, okay, I'm just gonna, we get an amethyst, we get another green gel, and we get another green gel, okay. And we get a score B. I'm gonna talk about this when I do this, oh, That water sound is horrible. <laughs> anyway, you want to close the valve. Because, well, you'll see. <sighs> Thank God that the valve took away the sound. Anyway, we got this, the score B, which will give Johnny the Samba skill. Which, I believe, is a damaging move. Yes, damage the enemies with a deadly sonic blast of notes. Sounds awesome. And we also got that Amethyst, which I'm gonna give to Johnny instead of the letter K. Yeah, very nice. So, now that the water has been turned off, and I think, nope, okay. You see, of course, there's no water in the, uh, the canals to this place either. So now we can actually walk on those places. Oh well. <laughs> Anyways, woo. Well, yeah, you know that something is wrong in a castle where a lord in a lord's castle when there are assassins in there which are not out to kill the lord itself. I know that's bad, but you know it's the truth. <laughs> anyway, the assassins are pretty fast guys. I don't like them. I don't like them at all. They are assassins and I usually like assassins. Okay, that sounded a little bit wrong, but I think you know what I mean. I mean, assassins are usually pretty cool. But in this game, they are just annoying. They don't have that much HP, but they can hurt you pretty bad if you let them. 
I don't even know why I say that so much. They can hit you pretty bad if you let if you let them. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. I mean, if you just oh new skill, if you just stand there and let them wail on you, of course they're gonna damage you. <laughs> anyway, Stan got a new skill in that battle, which is ooh vortex. I like this one a lot. Drags enemies into a vortex created by the user's spinning body. I'm gonna take my missile sword for this one because vortex is pretty cool. It is a very, very damaging skill. Is it? Yes, this is where I want to go. We get a melange gel. This uh. You know what? I'm gonna show off the, the vortex skill. Yeah, very cool. <laughs> I love John's thing in this game. If you can, if you can get into a big group of enemies and you use Vortex, it's gonna do massive damage. It is awesome. And in later entries in the Tail series, it's called Severing Wind. A very, it's not as awesome later on, but it's still pretty good, I'll say. Well worth it. There we go, let's see. Behind there we got a melange gel, nice. And a lemon gel, ooh, sweet. And a pine gel. Remember, check behind every big bush. Yeah, I know what I said. And here we get another creature, Jesus. And we get a halberd, which is not better than the mineral sword. Not by a long shot. Now, here we are. The reason why I got stuck in this place. It's not just that I got lost, it's because of this thing. You need to grab this thing, and you need to push it over here. Because if you don't, you will not be able to move anywhere in this place. And you see there's another one right here. So let's grab it, and push it. And put it right here. Okay. Alright, fine. <sighs> As I was trying to say, of course, put this box right here. Because we need to actually turn the water back on later on. Actually, I'm gonna show it. If you go over here, you have this door. And if you check it now, the door won't open because it needs electricity to open. Which you get by having the water on. And of course, I couldn't get over here with the water on because I didn't know I could grab onto these blocks. So I got very much stuck. <laughs> anyway, another orange gel right there, and that was a green gel right that I skipped. I hope so. <laughs> Sweet. In that battle, Rudy got a new spell, which is Ice Wall. Yes, there's a wall spell for pretty much every element. <laughs> Actually, I want to change my order around a little bit. I want to kick out Mary for a little while, and let's put Leon back in. Because a lot of fans has been... I'm just kidding. I just really want to have Leon in my party, and I want to check if he got something new. No. No, not really. And I believe, actually, Leon will not learn... Um, Vortex, so I might be wrong about that one though, but Vortex might be the first skill that Stan gets that, well, Leon doesn't. Anyway, now that, now that we have these platforms here, it's very, it's a lot easier to actually get back to the valve. So let's turn it back on. And let's get the heck out of here before our airs get raped. Hey. So, of course, now that the valve is back on, we can go through that door. But, actually, this is a very good time for you to go back and heal up at Liana's place. So, I think we're actually gonna do that. It's not really that far. And, there we go. Whoa, no, no encounters. That's very surprising. So, now that we have those platforms ready to be stepped on, and the water's back on, which will let us go to the next floor of Moreau Castle. So, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna end this off here, and in the next episode, I'm gonna meet you guys back in front of that door. 
And if you think the first floor is bad... Well, you're right, but the, ne the second floor, I believe, is the one that I got completely lost in. Or it might be the first floor. I can't even remember anymore. <laughs> anyway, so I thank you all for watching, and I see you all then.